Hey guys, been working on the boat a little bit. My dad helped me some. I'm cleaning up the area, so I put the metal on the top for now, but I'm going to get that home so I can start working on it. And then we're going to talk to the marina and see what it costs to get the boat home. Because uh, my mom used to have the marina come over and lift it out of the lake every winter. And she said it was $25 to put it in, or to lift it out, and $25 to put it in. But that was a long time ago. So we got it up, way up off the ground. It's hard to tell from this angle. We took a big board and we put it across. We got this in way up off the ground. Can you see that gap? And uh, I mean, you can see where the fin was down inside the dirt, down in there. See that? But there's no, from my, what I can tell, there's no rust holes. The um, paint needs to be flaked off and cleaned. And if there is any little holes, I'm thinking JB well to do it, but I don't think there's any holes. Uh, it just rains, so you're going to find some moisture underneath the paint here and there. Once that dries off, it'll be better and easier to tell. But we've been checking. There's no water in it. It's definitely not got water in it, and the, the bottom is solid. And it, it was sitting in pretty deep here. So I think it's going to be good. There's only one spot where I'm found a, a little bit of a deeper pit where was it now I can't see it now because it's drying out it could have been just the the uh, paint <sighs> yeah, bugs on me the paint was wet once I wire brush this I'll have a better look but there was one spot on here I can't even see it now because it's drying that didn't look very nice but I think it was just um, paint the paint was holding water because it rained all night so I've got to get all this paint off but I don't see any any holes or pits. Oh, there. Is it right there? No, I don't know now. There was one little area. I won't, uh, I'm going to have to get it home and get it up in the air higher. Oh, there it is. There's the only spot I was concerned about. But um, it's a pit. It's the only pit I found in the whole boat. I think J.B. Weld can take care of that, if anything. This side was deep in the ground really deep in the ground and we got it up quite a few inches off the ground now the camera just doesn't do it justice on the, the height of that off the ground but this is a a real 2x4 and it's got another 2x4 space underneath so at least it's four a good four or five inches I would say from the ground to that now all the way across it's raised up nicely so it'll air out and not that this short time is going to make any difference, but um, prevent any further rot and decay. There's another little pit. Not much of anything, just a little pit. I'll JB weld and, and fill in any any pits. Here's a pit. Now I can now I have it up in the air. I can see there's some pits here. See, they're not through, but I can see them. I think what I'll do is is you know fill them off with JB weld or some kind of putty. I think that'll be fine. You know, sand it flat, paint it. I think it'll be good. So looking right here, you can see all kinds of airspace under there. See that? So that's good. I'm satisfied for now until we get this home. I'll get all these metal parts home and start working on them here. And there we go, guys. It's going to start. It's going to start probably very soon here.